Hi everyone, here I am at Embedded World 2024. I have this logo behind me. And uh, yeah, this is the main entrance. Last day, a little bit less crowded. So I had a little bit of time to, to try to make a quick video for my team to, to show them, to give them a feeling of the event and decided to share it publicly, ultimately. We are here to present our solutions. We show how you can program directly from MATLAB and Simulink NXP solutions, NXP processors. So we actually presented the NXP battery management solution and motor control at Matworks booth. So it's, um, it was an honor to be invited by Matworks to, to present in their booth and we really appreciated that. Let me give you a quick tour of the event. You, you can get a feeling of how it is. It's, it's a huge place. Basically, we, I, I cannot cover in detail any, any of the booth. This video would be longer than social media accepted, <laughs> so I won't do that. I'll go very fast, I'll walk you through very quickly through, through the halls. You can get a feeling of what the embedded world looks like and feels like, maybe, in a, in a very, very compressed version of it. And uh, then we'll stop for a second to introduce you to the team and, you know, show you a little bit of what we've done and give you a bit further reference in case you're interested to check out some of the technologies. We'll take a look at NXP booth, we'll take a look at Matworks booth and I'll introduce you some members of the team who are presenting here and let them know, let them tell you what, what, we, what we talked about. One little advice, if you come to Nuremberg, to the embedded world, it's good not to stay in Nuremberg. Hotels here are incredibly expensive. Actually, what we've done, we stayed in Ingolstadt. It's not far from here. It's a half an hour train ride. It was actually a very nice morning coffee that we had in the train. So uh, if you come to Nuremberg during Embedded World, I think it's uh, smarter to stay outside Nuremberg. And uh, you, you can get a better deal even with hotels and everything if, if you stay a little bit outside. This is what we've done and it was a lot of fun. All right, let's go inside. It will be a very quick walkthrough. And let's stop at NXP booth, see a little bit how it looks. And then let's go to Matrox and, and talk to the team. All right, so here I have an XP booth behind me. Let me give you a very, very quick tour. So I'll compress everything in a quick shot. I hope you're not gonna get dizzy or something for compressing it too much. I'll give you a quick tour, give you a feeling of how it is, and uh, I'll leave it to that. Don't forget to check online. There is a lot of material that has been prepared and follow up on LinkedIn, nxp.com, and XP Semiconductors, and uh, find out more on the details of what has been presented. Here we are at Matworks booth. This is where the team has presented an XP solution, the BMS and motor control. Let me introduce you to them and uh, let's learn now more about how BMS is done, how motor control is done, and, <laughs> and uh, 
why MODLAB and Simulink is such a good solution for programming uh, NXP microcontrollers and processors. Let's have some fun with the guys. Hi, hello everyone. Hi. Welcome to the MathWorks booth at Embedded World. We as NXP are present this year at the MathWorks booth with a demo. So you can see here the demo that we are having and Marius behind me is explaining the, the, the demo that, that uh, is, present, is present this year with us. So you might be wondering why is NXP at MathWorks booth? Well, this is because we are developing a product, a solution which allows our customers to model and deploy actually complex algorithms from the Simulink environment directly on NXP processors. And why is this awesome? This is awesome because being able to model your ideas in the Simulink environment gives you access to a lots of routines that are already there, already present, already existing. You don't need to write the code, you don't need to think very much of sophisticated motor control algorithms or battery management system solutions, right? You have them all in one space. So you could use various products that MathWorks offers like motor control block set, Simscape battery, vehicle control toolbox, and all that kind of stuff to transform your, your ideas into, into real uh, implementations. You also have access to simulating this idea, so you don't need the hardware to test if the modern control algorithm that you're having is performing as you are expecting to. You can fit it with some test inputs, perform some verification and validation steps, and all this is offered by the power of simulation and automatic code generation. So basically for this demo, we have used two of our toolboxes, model-based design toolbox for the S32K3 platform, right? And then as an add-on on top of the S32K3, our customers could now use the toolbox which is specifically designed for battery management solutions. For more details, you could always reach out on us online, on the NXP community that we are having, and there you can find all kind of webinars and tutorials and customer interactions that we are having, and all the features that, or actually numerous features that we are uh, targeting in our toolbox is being explained and highlighted in various threads and videos. And of course, for more details about this specific video, you should talk to Marius. <laughs> We are here at the Matters booth showing uh, our high voltage battery management system demo with cloud integration. We have the battery management system uh, composed by uh, reference design that NXP provides. We have the battery management unit connected to the cell monitoring unit and to the battery junction box. We are measuring cell voltages, temperatures and of course the current. We are using these potentiometers to provide inputs to the battery cell monitoring unit. And uh, here we have the S32 uh, G3, actually we have the gold box connected via, via the CAN bus to the, the BMS. And the main scope here is to push data into cloud. So in terms of software, what we are, what, why we are here at the Matters boot is that all the algorithm running on our um, uh, high voltage battery management unit has been generated directly from Simulink. We are basically using a, a Simulink model, a Simulink battery management model uh, we have populated with our, with our blocks and we can access peripherals and also we can communicate with our cell monitoring units with a, a battery junction box so that we measure currents, voltages and temperatures from our pack. And also we are using the Gold VIP to push data into cloud because we, are, we, we offer this Gold, uh, Gold VIP solution so that customers just uh, configure the AWS, uh, especially the Fleetwise service is something that we use to push data into cloud and to um, run campaigns to gather important data that helps us to make our algorithm better. So for example, we have, um, we have a MathWorks um, example, a MathWorks running in the cloud, which um, gets the data from our AWS um, uh, S3, the bucket S3, and then um, process the data so that we can retrain our neural network SOC estimation algorithms for additional parts of the model which can be improved once we have uh, better data. So we are using Fleetwise service because um, of course here we have only one 
um, one kit, but it can, can scale up to an entire fleet, right? And you can start campaigns to gather um, only the data you are interested in to retrain SOC or any other algorithms. A part of that, um, we have another example showing the vehicle network toolbox, which is um, which is um, a similar way to record data coming directly from the from the um, uh, battery management unit, and then uh, replay the data to uh, develop uh, other algorithms or to um, let's say test our algorithms in 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 the same and the same and the same scenarios as well. Um, yeah, and I think that's pretty much it. Thank you very much. See you next year as well at Embedded Work. Yeah, so as I said, NXP is everywhere. We actually had the second booth. It's, uh, it's behind me, it's outside. It was dedicated to MCX and a lot of uh, demos uh, showing our microcontrollers capabilities. Go on and check NXP.com, follow us on social media. There are a lot of announcements these days. There are a lot of new technologies, a lot of new software platforms that are announced and presented. So, so stay close, find out more details. Um, you can always check our community on nxp.com, model-based design tools. This is our team. This is the work Irina and Marius and Stefan and our team is doing. So you can find out more. Make the most out of MATLAB and Simulink because this is a smart way to do simulation, to do programming, to use toolboxes and libraries which are already available. And uh, yeah, stay close and follow us and find out more. Thank you all for watching and I hope it was useful and you found out something new. Thanks.